before they won Super Bowls. What a ride it's been. Before they were America's team. The Cowboys first had to win the city of Dallas. I heard my father tell the stories about the battle, and it, it was a battle uh, that took place between the AFL and the NFL. When Kansas City Chiefs owner and Dallas businessman Clark Hunt spoke at the Park City Club last week about his Super Bowl-bound team, right next to the Chiefs helmet was a piece of history. We appreciate the team's history uh, in Dallas. We signed the, many of the top players in the country in the American Football League. Clark's father, Lamar Hunt, wanted to bring pro football to his hometown of Dallas, and he got the chance with the Dallas Texans of the AFL. Their history is preserved in the SMU Jones Film Library. Two of the men who had a lot to do with this uh, victory today, Abner, congratulations on... Worried the upstart league would steal the heart of Texas, the NFL responded by putting a team in Dallas called the Cowboys. From 1960 to 62, the two teams shared the Cotton Bowl, battling it out for players and for fans. Our third year will definitely be a crucial year, and we feel very optimistic. But despite Lamar Hunt's optimism, that third season was their last. The power of the established NFL won out, and the Texans moved to Kansas City, having never played the Cowboys on the field. I know that my dad, uh, deep in his heart, wanted to challenge the Cowboys to play, uh, but I'm sure the Cowboys wouldn't have accepted the game for fear of being embarrassed by the upstart AFL. So the Dallas Texans versus the Dallas Cowboys, the game that never was Looks until... Middle. Looks and throws into the end zone, caught for a touchdown! When the Cowboys and Chiefs played in 2009, both teams wore the same uniforms they wore at the Cotton Bowl. The Chiefs transformed into the Texans. The game went into overtime, and like 50 years earlier, Austin saved the day! It was the Cowboys who triumphed. But if you need a team to root for Sunday, just remember that Arrowhead came from the heart of Texas. In Dallas, I'm Chris Sadegui.